Pilots like us have been waiting for this for years. It's finally here. We've got the iPad Mini 5, and this is the best iPad I've ever flown with in the cockpit. When I tweeted a photo of flying with the iPad Mini 5 in the cockpit, I got lots of questions. Pilots asking for reviews, asking for a pie rope. Lots of pilots ask me, why is the iPad Mini so important? It's really about size. It's the perfect form factor for a small general aviation cockpit. Anything small like an iPhone just feels silly to me. And then anything larger than the iPad Mini just feels stupid. Really, it's the perfect size for flying. If you run an iPad Mini 4 next to an iPad Mini 5 with most sort of aviation electronic flight bag kind of applications, they're pretty much the same. The iPad Mini 5 is a bit snappier. I upgraded to the iPad Mini 5 because I really wanted the better battery life, the processor is three times as fast, and I always wanted to try copying a clearance with the Apple Pencil. One of the best tests I can think of was taking it up in a Mooney. So we flew from Chicago Executive to Monroe, Wisconsin. Good afternoon, Executive Clearance Mooney 7 Lima Uniform is uh, IFR to Monroe Echo Foxtrot Tango, ready to copy clearance. Mooney 7 Lima Uniform, clearance, we removed all, all your fixes in there. It's, you're going to get radar vectors, Monroe Echo Foxtrot Tango. Time to maintain 2,000, expect 6,000. One zero minutes after departure, car departure frequency be 120.55, squawk 5305. Okay, Mooney, 7 Lima Uniform cleared to Monroe via radar vectors. 2,000, expect 6,000, 10 minutes after departure, 12055 on the frequency, 5305 on the squawk. 7 Lima Uniform, read back correct, information with you current. Okay, 7 Lima Uniform, thanks. Executive ground, Mooney 7 Lima Uniform, Area 2 with Whiskey, ready to taxi. Mooney 7 Lima Uniform, Area 2, taxi to runway 16 via Bravo, Echo, Kilo, cross runway 24. Okay, Bravo, Echo, Kilo, cross 24 to 16, 7 Lima Uniform. Clear right and clear left. There is a pretty day to fly. Yeah, it is. A little windy, but uh, definitely pretty day to fly. Throttle, flight controls, watch your knees nuts. And left, right, forward, right, left. Free and correct. Yeah, that's something with the iPad I always check is making sure that all the cables and mounts right. and everything haven't interfered with any of the controls. Yeah, especially these guys. Yep, absolutely. And Executive Tower Mooney, 7 Lima Uniform, holding short 1-6, ready for departure. Morning, seven uniform, seven Lima uniform, executive tower, turn left, left turn heading three six zero, runway one six, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff one six, heading left turn, heading three six zero, seven Lima uniform. And we're up to two thousand feet, and we're off at six twenty. Finals clear. Okay. So seven uniform Delta, runway one six, line up and wait. Here is traffic, seven out. Line on way one six, seven uniform Delta.
When he's seven, Lima Uniform, 360 in the heading, contact Chicago, departure, good day. Okay, over to departure, seven Lima Uniform, thanks. Chicago departure, Mooney, seven Lima Uniform, climbing through 1,300 for 2,000, heading 360. Seven Lima Uniform, Chicago departure, radar contact. Are you looking for traffic? I'm kind. Of, I'm on my gauges, even though the hood's not on. You got it. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Seventeen for two. Eighteen for two. Got a couple of targets off on that side. Looks like they're descending into the pattern. Okay. I'm looking. No factor. Excellent. Uniform climb maintain 4,000. Okay, leaving 2,000 for 4,000, 7 Lima Uniform. Trailblazer 499, departure radar contact, see direct north for. It feels like the ride calmed down a bit. Yeah. Everything looks good. Seven Lima Uniform, turn left heading 270. Left turn 270, 7 Lima Uniform. Tango Whiskey climb maintain 8,000. Thank you. Climb maintain 8,000, 8 Tango Whiskey. Yeah, I can barely see the gauges with the sun. Blazer 499, maintain 2,500, airport 11 o'clock and 10 miles. Blazer 499, maintain 2,500. Leveling 4. Leveling 4. So much for uh, coming down. Put us uh, in a little bit of a... Bumpy area. I'm sorry, that's my bump. Blizzard 499, airport 11 o'clock, 9 miles. Blizzard 499, that's good visual approach, executive contact tower 119.9. Eight hey, Tango Whiskey, contact Rockford approach, 121.0. 121.0, uh, 8 one point zero. Hey, Tango Whiskey. All right, maybe I'll throw the hood on. I've got controls. Okay, you got the point. Uh, okay, I got it. You've got controls. I got controls. No winds being reported at uh, Monroe. Oh, really? Okay. Scattered 6,500. Visibility 10, but not, uh, nothing reported for the wind. Oh, oh, uh, it's not that it's wind's calm, just no wind report. Yeah, I saw that earlier. So I, I looked at Janesville. Uh, I think they were out of the north before. Yeah, they were uh, TAF is uh, 320, so. Yeah. I mean, I think we can expect, uh, well, I'll, I'll ask for the, uh... An RNAV 3-0 or a VOR DME 3-0. Uh, we'll do this, maybe Davis, and maybe do the hold at Davis, too. Okay. Seven Lima Uniform, what's your encore setting to your destination? Seven Lima Uniform, stand by.
I'm showing 296. And uh, 298 degrees, 7 limit uniform. 7 limit uniform, Roger. Fighting 290. 290, 7 limit uniform. Yeah, actually, if we're going to go to Davis, uh, it's the initial approach fix. It's 7 limit uniform, climb maintain 6,000. Okay, leaving 4,000 for 6,000, 7 limit uniform. Seven Lima Uniform, proceed to Direct Monroe. Direct Monroe, Seven Lima Uniform. Okay, level in six. Seven Lima Uniform, contact Rockford Approach, 121.0. 1210, Seven Lima Uniform. Rockford Approach, Mooney 7, Lima Uniform, 6,000. Twin Comanche 82, Yankee Descend and maintain 5,000. Skybus 3040, Descend and maintain 10,000, maintain 300 knots. Center maintain 10,000, 300 knots, Skybus 3040. Bonanza 43, Charlie, contact Madison Approach, 135.45. Good altitude. Day. the hell? I tried to recapture it with my autopilot, but that didn't quite work. And Rockford Approach, Mooney 7 Lima Uniform, 6000. Mooney 7 Lima Uniform, Rockford Approach, Rockford Altimeter 3031, advise when you have the Monroe weather, expect a visual approach. Okay, 3031 will advise when we get the weather, and uh, actually we'd like the uh, RNAV 30 if possible. 27 Lima Uniform, Roger. You can expect the RNAV 30 approach to Monroe. Okay, 7 Lima Uniform, Roger. Try this again. Should be working. 27 Lima Uniform, in about 7 miles, expect direct SOD for the RNAV 30 approach. 7 Lima Uniform, Roger, and it was uh, direct Davis, you said? No, 7 Lima Uniform negative, expect direct uh, Zodi X-O-T-I-Y uh, for the RNAV 3-0. Okay, 7 Lima Uniform, Roger, we'll expect direct Zodi. Bonanza 136 Tango Bravo, Rockford Approach, Rockford Altimeter 3032. Uh, I don't have Zodi is, uh... It's not on, I guess it's not on the approach. It yeah. is... It's, it's uh, an initial fix, yeah, that's the initial. problem. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Plot of 395 Whiskey, Rockford Approach, Rockford Altimeter 3031. Expect visual approach runway 32 to Janesville. Descend and maintain 3,000, and I'll have visual approach clearance for you in about 10 miles. Three, three, niner, Zulu, weather, wind, missing, visibility, one, zero, clear, below, one, two, thousand, temperature, three, Celsius, two point, minus, one, three, altimeter, three, zero, two, six, Gainesville showing uh, 290 at 8. Okay. Monroe, Mooney, 7 Lima Uniform, proceed direct Zodi. Okay, direct Zodi, and uh, 7 Lima Uniform has the weather at Monroe. Mooney, 7 Lima Uniform, Roger. Oh, that didn't change much. <laughs> nope. All right, 12305 for the common. You nice and toasty? I'm going to turn the heat to just down a little bit. Whatever's comfortable for you. Yep. I'm good. Okay. You having fun? Yeah, this is great. Very pretty. Good. A little bit smoother up here at 6 yeah. than I was at 4. Definitely. Yeah, the approach is probably going to be a little bumpy. So, 290 on the winds, almost from the front. Um, Lotus, 9 or 5, Whiskey, cleared visual approach, runway 32, Janesville. 
Alright, well we can brief the approach. Yeah, so our course is going to be 301, we've got the RNAV 30 at Monroe, 5,000 feet to land. We do have the local altimeter so we don't have to worry about these notes. Uh, we're not circling. You can expect probably our next standoff is going to be 1260. Maybe. Yep. Uh, okay, 12305 I've got uh, set up in COM2. And from Zodi, it's just straight into 301, 302 heading. It's going to be an LNAV approach, so it's not an LPV. So altitude, I don't know if I'm going to get the, gui the uh, suggested guidance. I'm still a little fuzzy about that, but uh, I'm just going to shut off my, I got my vent on. Ah. There we go. Put on just a little. Plotus 9 or 5 Whiskey, radar service is terminated. Contact Janesville Tower 118.8. Have a good day. From Zodi down to Zerdu, Zer Zebru, Zebru is the final approach fix. We go from 3 to 27. Yep. And then after Zebru, we go down to 1480. Uh, okay. And our missed approach is going to be left turn 3,000, climbing left turn 3,000 feet to Davis. That's in the flight plan. We're going to enter the hold, and it'll be a direct entry, looks like. That'll be the, yeah, direct entry. Yep, that checks. Okay. Um, i do my acronym just to make sure we haven't missed anything. So, A MICE ATM, A altimeter setting. I haven't put it in yet, but we have it. It's 3026. That's actually pretty significantly off from what we are now, but for separation, I'm going to keep. I'm not putting it in yet. Uh, a mice, so marker beacon doesn't matter. Identify or haven't identified it yet, but it'll we'll know when we get the approach. Uh, we go from terminal to approach. That's what I use instead of the marker beacon. Uh, and make sure we're on GPS, which we are. And then the course is straight in. Uh, entry, just a direct straight in entry. Uh, altitude 3027 for the final approach fix 1480 and missed approach climbing left turn 3000 Davis direct entry. Copy. Tony 7 Lima uniform. Do you send and maintain 3000? Okay, leaving 6000 for 3000 7 Lima uniform. And that is the uh, published altitude for the approach. Yep, about a 387 with E Rockford approach, Rockford altimeter 3032. Expect visual approach runway 32, Janesville. Descend and maintain 3000 and uh, give me a good rate down uh, to 3000. I won't be able to clear you until you get it below traffic, but that's at 4000. 387 with the uh, good rate down to 3000. 27 Lima uniform, 2-4 miles from Zodi, cross Zodi, at or above 3,000, cleared RNAV 3-0 approach, Monroe. Okay, cross Zodi, at or above 3,000, cleared for the RNAV 3-0, Monroe, 7 Lima uniform. Alright, you've got the crossing restriction at Zodi, plenty yep. of room. They slower up just because yeah, we're going to be descending into some bumpier air. I don't want to bang my head on the ceiling if avoid that. Yeah. See what we can do. Plenty of room. If we don't mind. Sure. What you up to? Uh, fuel scheduler. Oh, yeah. Could probably do some of that. Up to 20 after, so. That was good to check. Yeah. Oh, we're right about there on the fuel, so. Let's see. No airports around, but. That's all right. Boost pump on. Boost pump off. I realize now why the electric trim didn't work. Yeah, this is uh, this is why it's not good to let rust build. I went to shut the boost pump off, and I put all right, of course. Really having trouble slowing this plane down. You know, I don't want to pull power back so much that we uh, shock cool the engine. But there we go. The rule I was given a long time ago is uh, two inches every two minutes. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's a good... Here we 
There you go, getting back on there. Audit 87 Whiskey, radar service is terminated. Contact Gainesville Tower, 118.8. Have you make man? this a full stop or are you going to yeah, just make it do a full a approach? I'll make it a full stop. Okay. Figure out what to do from there. Colony 854, flight heading 19er, or correction 200, vector 4 visual approach. Fighter left, uh, 200, Colony 854. That clears up a bit as we uh, go yeah. farther west. Oh, yeah? Colony 854, descend and maintain 4,000. 13 miles. 4,000, Colony 854. 1,000 to go. Yep. Colony 854, traffic 12 o'clock and 7 miles northwest bound, 3,200 indicated. Okay, we're looking for traffic, Colony 854. Dan and scope is clear, it's just us chickens out here. Excellent. Excellent. I'm surprised. Such a nice Sunday evening. 35 for 3. County 854, turn right heading 220. Right heading 220, County 854. Nine miles, you can work your way down 200 feet. Yeah. And then I'll have six miles between this and my final uh, approach fix to slow down, get the gear down, get stabilized. Roger. All right, you're now on the plate, looking good. County 854, Janesville Airport. I'm not on my plate, damn it. 10 miles reported in sight. And it's not, oh, not a, uh, I keep having this problem, it's current. County 854, cleared visual approach runway 32, yeah. Janesville. Right. Clear for this old 32, County 854, thank you. I usually fly it with the chart and the plate depicted translucently on the chart. And the reason I like that is it gives me traffic as well. Yep, you're right. should do that, but I got a, too much uh, too much button pushing for right now. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm flying it off here. Aviate, navigate, then communicate in that order. County 854, radar service is terminated. Contact Jamesville Tower, 118.8. Have a good day. Okay, on the Tower 18.8. I'm in the visual. Uh, County 854. Oh, See ya. Got to do this. Uh, no. Yeah, you already activated it. I, I guess. guess I had, yeah. Watch your heading. You looked right and banked right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yankee descend up pilot's discretion. And I looked for too long. All right, let's go get that altitude. Yep. That's the gear alarm. Continue. Yeah. yeah. I just like to say it out loud. Okay. I can hear it out loud. Archer 598, contact Madison approach 120.1, good name. 120.1, good day. Yeah, I definitely have not done this in a while. That's why we come up here and practice. Yep. Okay. So after Zodi, down to 27. That checks. All right, you're past Zodi, down to 2700. Yep. Clear ahead. Nothing on the scope. Nope. November 7, Lima Uniform, report IFR cancellation in the air. On this frequency or on the ground through the remote uh, communication frequency, change to advisory frequency approved. Okay, 7, Lima Uniform, roger. Just to keep it real, I'm not going to cancel right now. All right, we can do it on the RCO. Yeah, let's pretend uh, like it's real. So 27, still zero boo. And heading. Southwest 3336, Rockford approach, Rockford altimeter 3032. Showing you a little left, of course. Yep, got it. Want to make your CTOP call? Yeah, sure. Go ahead, would you? Sure. It's seven miles out, I think. Seven miles east. 
Monroe Road traffic, Monroe Road traffic, Mini 7 Lima uniform, 7 miles uh, on the RNAV for 30 Monroe. Monroe traffic, Cessna 723903, clear runway 30, taxiing to fuel, Monroe. Uh, traffic at Monroe, say winds. They appear to be favoring runway 30. Appreciate that. Got a human ASOS down there. Yep. Okay, I've got the field in sight. Excellent. Down to 1480. Five, four and a half miles. Still a little left of course. Okay, 23 for 14 B. Call it 15. And Monroe traffic, Mooney on a 4 mile fall on our runway 30 Monroe. I blow my glide slope, but that's not that important as long as I level off at 14 8. Eighteen fifteen. So one dot left. Yeah. There you go. Sixteen for fifteen. Ah, uh, get back here. Fifteen hundred, and there's my runway. Here, undercarriage, mixture, and prop all set. Yep. I see a gear down light. Excellent. Monroe traffic, uh, Mooney is short final for 3-0 Monroe. Yeah, I've never been here before. Crowd pleaser. Yeah. Not Ooh. bad. It's smoother than this runway. <laughs> yeah. True. I think I've been here twice. Oh, really? I think I've picked up a couple of airplanes here uh, on uh, ferry gigs. I was trying to remember why it sounded familiar. Very nice F, um, sort of terminal FBO building. Oh, really? Yeah. That wasn't so bad. I mean, it wasn't perfect. It was fine. Some pretty airplanes on the ramp. Yeah. One of them, they're Moonies. wonder how much gas is. Out of curiosity. See on your iPad? Let's see. 396 a gallon. Not bad. It's not the 369 of Burlington, but not bad. Not bad at all. Thank you, baby.